back to today on Wags Tail Wednesday. There will be no show and tell. This will only be maybe calling a tip or food for more. When you're doing route work, I reiterated a few times before, and I'm going to reiterate it again because you'll have all different types of scenarios why you would want to uh, do this little tip. Now, in business, when you're doing route work, it's customary to get to know the owners and be friendly with the owners. That means talkative, ask them how their day is better, ask them how their business is doing. And I told you the reasons why you want to do this. Not only are you showing them that, that you care as an individual and as a business partner, because it's a relationship. You can't have one with the other. Both of us together create the benefits. He gets exceptional service, and I reap the rewards from it, meaning getting paid. Now, you want to keep asking them how's business been because you want to know about your job security with them. You know, because if he's not doing good, guess what? That means you're not going to do good either, at least with that account, because service could be terminated for any number of reasons. Now, it just so happens that I just came from a diner. The service wasn't terminated, but I did not know that it changed ownership. The guy that previously owned it owns 13 diners, over 100 houses in Philadelphia, he owns a hotel, two hotels in Greece, in Greece and he's having another hotel built. So these people got money, got money like crazy, all right? And I did not know he had all this. I knew he had the 13 diners, but I didn't know he had over 100 homes, plus a couple hotels. I mean, that family's doing it up and doing it big. So, um, a new owner who owns another diner down the street, from the diner that I was just built. And he, I, he introduced himself. So I got to talking about, you see, this is why you want to talk to people. I got to talking to some customers in there and they were all cops, local cops in the township. And they were saying, they don't know how this place stays open. Now see, this is the reason why you want to communicate because you want to know what's going on. I think it's beneficial to us as a business owner to know what's going on. After all, we can be the last people to know anything. And we usually have to find out the hard way. So in order to alleviate that, you should ask questions. You should be poking around. So the customer, the cops, said that they don't know how they stay open. They never see anybody in here. I said, yeah, I never see anybody in here too. I knew it was just a matter of time before they either sell the business or they just can't afford to stay open anymore. The diner is open 24 hours. Now, I imagine that, uh, you know, they have their, their days where they're not slow. Every business does. All right? But that's just what I'm saying, man. You got to know who you're dealing with. And you got to know what you're getting yourself into. Because it may not be secure or forever. If you're not putting them under a contract, then you better keep in, in touch with the owner. Ask them how their day has been. Make sure you have their cell phone. I never saw the old owner. He was hardly ever there. I mean, when you got 13 diners, it's kind of hard to be at all of them overseeing everything. So I never saw him. And uh, not even once, not even when I, I got hired. So uh, this owner, he, he seems to want to be involved and 
the businesses that he's in. After all, he only has a couple anyway. Yeah, when you talk to people and you ask questions or you make people want to talk to you, like I said, this is a conversation starter. You could pull the direction, the conversation into your direction, however you see fit. People will reveal all types of stuff that maybe you might be interested in. For instance, when I was talking to the officers in there about business and that they never see it, you know, busy in there, he told me about Olga's Diner. Now, uh, Olga's used to be a diner, a famous diner, been around for a while. They're opening up very soon. And I, I thank them for giving me the heads up because I did not know this. So now not only did I find something out that's vital to my business, it's a possibility that I can get the account because they haven't opened yet. So uh, join me pretty soon for a live canvassing on that job as I try to sell it. Uh, I see I wouldn't have never found that if I hadn't reluctantly uh, talked to the officers sitting down. You know, uh, you got to get into a habit of getting used to talking to not just the owner and the employees, but also talk to customers as well. Because customers will indubitably want to have your card. They will ask you for it. They might be want to do business with you in the future. But uh, there you have it. I'll see you in the next one. Macka fracka lacka. Peace, peace, peace. Yeah, well, I, I built that one on the ground. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Let me show you. Uh, this This is a wagtail. You ever heard of it? No. You never heard of a wagtail? No. How long you been doing this? Long enough. I ain't never heard that one. Though. Really? Yeah. Like five or six years I've been doing this. Oh, job. man. You got to get one of these. This is going to step your game up. <laughs> you talking about being home early. That's being home early. This is I a see, dual pivot. I see you got the squeeze on the bottom and the mouth on top. Let me show you something. <laughs> this I, I made myself. Uh, you can add this to it. You'll never have to walk around yeah, with no yeah, bucket. Uh, I can clean about 200 and something windows with this. With water, it may right? not be look like a lot of water, but look. Job, though, right? That's the way that was designed. Yeah, see, I, I nice, isn't it? It's probably called Mormon. There's a there's a couple of them. Uh, yeah, but man, yeah. You, you, you get that tool, uh, search for a wagtail, man. Right, right, Once right. you start using that, you ain't going to want to use that sword bow anymore. Yeah, man, I'm telling yeah. you, you won't like that. I'm telling you. All right, man, what's your name, Jay? Yeah, yeah. Nice to meet you. All right, thanks, bro. All right take it easy. All right.